With high utility rates following us into 2023, it can be stressful and scary trying to figure out how to make ends meet. 2822 Eyewitness News reporter Emily Allegrucci joins us now live in the Control Center to show us how to get some help if you are struggling to pay these rising prices. Emily? Good evening, Candace and Andy. Utility costs have been rising at an alarming rate. Many people have taken to shopping around for new energy suppliers, but with such high prices, even the most reasonable suppliers out of the price range for some. I stopped by a local nonprofit earlier today and learned about different programs and resources that can assist those who may need it. Inflation was the talk of 2022. In 2023, the talk continues with high cost of utilities stealing the show. We're already seeing it in the new year in 2023 of more people needing utility assistance and housing assistance. Electric supplier PPNL offers Shopping 101 on their website, a way for people to learn more about shopping for their electricity source and finding the right supplier for them. But for some, not even switching suppliers can help them to afford the rising cost of their utility bill. The rising utilities is definitely affecting individuals and families and paying and meeting their other expenses, and that is a great concern. A Scranton nonprofit, United Neighborhood Centers of Northeastern Pennsylvania, offers programs that can assist individuals and families with utility crises. The mission of United Neighborhood Center goes beyond just helping people in need. They want to educate those who come to them in order to build long-term stability and independence. The first step is showing up. So I would encourage people to come in, uh, have us um, see what their situation is, so we can not only help them, we can educate them and refer them to other sources that can also help them. UNC will first refer you to the County Assistance Office, home of resources that specifically help with utilities such as the Low Income Home Energy Assistance Program, better known as LIHEAP. If these resources do not fit your specific situation, UNC will then take your case into their hands. The combination of referring them, making phone calls and having established um, other agencies to refer them to, you try to find a way to make it work one way or another. UNC offers several other programs and resources for needs that unexpectedly may arise due to high cost of utilities. You can find more out about UNC services and PPNL's electricity shopping advice on our website, PA homepage.